The video you are seeing is not a Petrotech demonstration, but is in fact the account of an insurance adjuster charged with the responsibility to assess the damage and ultimate cleanup cost of four tons of bunker sea oil spilled by one of their insured. A tank filled with four tons of bunker sea oil ruptured and deposited its contents over a 4,000 square yard area, including an adjacent metal working shop. Subjected to the elements, the oil quickly turned to a tar-like substance. An ensuing heavy rainfall caused the oil to be spattered even onto the walls of the metal working shop, adding to the cleanup problem. Israel's Petrotech distributor was notified to inspect and ultimately to proceed with the cleanup. A pressure washing truck was moved to the scene, filled with a 3% solution of Petrotech and pressurized to 150 PSI before the cleanup began. It was quite evident after the first application that the process might have to be repeated several times. However, it was clear to see that after only the second application, even the original paint markings on the floor had become visible again. Although some of the heavily contaminated metal parts required cleaning by hand. The entire effluent of the cleanup was deemed ready for biodegradation and passed for introduction into the sewer system. To accomplish the entire task, only one and a half barrels, 80 U.S. gallons, were used. The balance of the second barrel was left behind for the metal working shop to deal with possible residues caused by heavy rainfalls that might occur in the future. 